Welcome, it's Facts You Don't Know. If it's your first time here and you want to find out new facts that will definitely make you smarter and more. Well, and for make sure to subscribe and active the notification bell so you don't miss anything. Single woman adopts six sisters and three years later reveals that there's just nothing like growing up with a child. While it will come with a bit of conflict, competition that can begin at infancy, and a lot of shared space growing up. Both siblings have a special bond that lasts throughout their lives if they are fortunate. Unfortunately, often siblings going through adoption and fostering processes are split, causing them to be denied the special bond. Yet there are also parents like Lassie Duncan who have ensured that nobody in a family of six adorable sisters has never felt isolated. While she had to go through quite a few hoops to ensure she had control over the big family, she never once refused to take on the girls' party. Check below to read more about this amazing story of adoption and see pictures of the six children. Lassie Duncan has known since age 25 that she wanted to be a mother, whether she ever got married or not. And after she became certified to adopt in June 2011, she received a phone call that would change her life forever. The caller was seeking a foster parent to take on not one, not two, but four sisters at once. Duncan agreed without hesitation, and the girls moved in with her and her parents right away. I can tell you why I felt so compelled to say yes, but I did, she said, and I didn't even consider not keeping them together. It was all or nothing to me, she explained to Count Relivin. Sadly, their birth mother obtained custody of all four girls following nine months of bonding with the children, including a neonate who had been staying with another family. But instead, about a month later, Duncan got another mad phone call, this time from the birth mother herself. The biological mother of the girls had determined that she did what was best for her children, and so she agreed to give them to Duncan. Yet the decision of the birth mother came with one major request. She wanted to know if Duncan would be able to adopt all the children, including the newborn. Though Duncan enthusiastically and wholeheartedly accepted the bid, there were no stops to the adoption surprises. The mother discovered during the year-long adoption cycle that she was pregnant with a sixth child. Of course, Duncan also decided to adopt the infant, totaling six little girls she'd be adopting. Although the procedure was certainly unorthodox, it could not be any easier for the family to get all the sisters together. They bring me so much joy and chaos, but life would be so empty and bland and boring without them, explained Lassie to Count Relimin. It's an honor to be their mother, they melt my heart. Around three years have passed since the monumental adoption, and Duncan feels so fortunate for her six daughters. Sophia 9, Natalie and Melanie both 7, Kaylee 6, Leia 4, and Cecily 2. All get to grow up together with a mother who never hesitated taking them on as an entire family. Recently, Duncan shared a touching photo on Facebook of all her lovely daughters gathered together, she wrote. So I was nominated in the mother who dared to post on picture that makes me proud or happy to be a mom. I chose this picture. I choose this picture not because it's a beautiful picture, although it is, but because of the memory of taking this picture, the memory of the chaos and stress that preceded this beautiful happy picture of me and my girls. What you don't see is the yelling, pleading, bargaining that went on prior to this picture, the tears and whining and pouting and me flipping out saying, all I want is one nice picture of us all. Is that too much to ask? You don't see me asking my mom to race down to the park, me texting my sweet photographer that it's been the morning from hell, or me rudely honking at a woman who was taking her sweet time to close her door so we could park. Not my best moment. This picture reminds me that even during the hard times, life is beautiful, that pressure produces diamonds, and that things don't have to be perfect to be great. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks. We'll be right back to you as fast as we can.